Float to Outbound's incredible interstellar amusement park, where you can enjoy five planets for the price of one. He loves to hear his own lips flap, but I gotta hand it to the Eggster. This place is epic. Everyone and their brother is gonna wanna come here. No doubt, but now I'm not sure why we're here. This place looks totally harmless. Because Eggman plus secretly built amusement park equals evil plot for us to foil. Lucky for us, he's not very good at keeping things hidden. True, it would be pretty hard to miss a giant floating space amusement park surrounded by planets. Still, an evil plot? I don't know. Whoa. Wow! Plot or not, you can't be mad at this view. This place has taken beauty to the next level. I'm just surprised that it was so easy to sneak in here. Uh, I wouldn't say it was that easy. Hello, happy people. Buckle up as Eggman's ultra-accelerating space elevator whisks you to an interplanetary wonderland of fun. I can't believe somebody was dumb enough to leave the keys in this thing. It's like Eggman's begging us to sneak in and trash the place. Oh, man, this thing's got crazy fast acceleration. <laughs> you call this fast? This amusement park has been constructed entirely out of a sense of remorse for my past transgressions and is in no way associated with any sort of evil plot or premeditated misdeeds. Well, that's a relief. Makes my head feel like it wants to. Huh? Oh, Your voice chip is stuck on cowboy again. Stop talking and meet those aliens. I'm not sure what's going on. But I'm sure of what I'm gonna do. Huh? Hey, what's going on? Huh? Whoa!
automatic capacitor to the maximizing modulationizer. I wish I knew what you were saying, little guy, or gal, or whatever you are. Oh, man, that was crazy! Oh, I was reconfiguring my handheld into a translator so I can understand this guy. Did you go somewhere? Didn't you see? I absorbed those aliens and got powered up with, like, some kind of wild energy. And after a few seconds, they'd pop out of me. Uh, I find that hard to believe. Huh? Okay, seriously? We need to find Eggman and figure out how catching these aliens fits into whatever heinous plan he's hatching. And wreck that plan, right? Yeah, that's pretty much how we spend our time.
25. Ah, not nearly enough aliens! Want us to get more? No, I want you to get me a cheeseburger and a shake. That'll be easier. Cheeseburgers don't run as fast as them little alien farmers. Idiot, get me more aliens. Y'all want fries with that? Go! I reckon that hurt a bit. Wait a minute, I need to go over yonder. Sorry. Hmm. Precious little aliens! I'll harness their hyper-go-on power, and then nothing will stop me! I know I say that every time, but this time, really, nothing will stop me! <laughs> Boss? What? Sonic! Who are you calling nothing? Huh? He means since the boss said nothing will stop me, and Sonic here is going to stop him, it's like the boss was calling Sonic nothing. Great! I thought nobody would get that. Fine. You're so smart, robot. You take care of this mess. Release the big boy! At least I know he won't screw it up. Hasta la bye-bye, suckers! <laughs> It's time for me to start stopping. I get it. Shopping, grabbed a bite to eat, and trashed a giant killer robot. Oh, really? And they've got shopping here, too? This place has everything. Hey, so how's your translator thingy coming along? Uh, I think it's done. It's in binary code, so only I can read it. Okay, ask away. <clears throat> Who are you, and what is happening to your people? Okay, he says his name is Toxalot, and he's from a faraway soda, and where flowers water them with dances. Yeah, uh, I think your machine still has some bugs. Yeah, I think I can figure this out, though. Okay, he said his name is Yakker. He's from a race of beings called Wisps. Wisps? No, Wisps, with a W. Yeah, I'll just stick with aliens if that's okay with everybody. Oh, sure. So anyway, they're either being used for their magical powers by an evil man, or to make underwear to be worn by Sally. Oh. And just here, save them, save them over and over. When I was running around trashing robots, I saw a map that had a couple of interesting places. I think I'll go check them out and maybe save some aliens. The mouse man said to wrangle every piece of this mess. When you consider what we're doing from a robot's point of view, it's actually pretty impressive. Don't think about it. If you say so. <laughs> I'm missing an arm. Have you got an arm? No, but really, how much can it matter? 
I guess it can't matter much.